A simple eyebrow flash. What is it? What does it really mean? When you look at someone and when someone looks at you and you see the eyebrows go up, okay? Uh, the eyebrow flash. What does that really mean? It's been a lot of research from body language experts, been a lot of research from people in the field of you know, physiology, neuro-linguistic programming, et cetera. And there's something about an eyebrow flash that number one tells you that you've caught the attention of someone, okay? Or that someone's making emphasis. If you're watching someone and they're telling you something, the eyebrow goes up. It can mean surprise. It can mean that there is a level of significance. How do we use this? How do we use this in conversation? Well, one of the things that you can do when you first meet someone, now this is really powerful face-to-face, -face, but with Zoom, it can be done as well. What I want to do when I first meet someone is a smile and an eyebrow flash. Sounds simple, right? Like, hey, hey, good, you know, there's it's, it's difference than, hey, good to meet you. And, hey, what does it do? Now, why would a simple eyebrow flash? And guys, I have very light eyebrows. Those with darker caterpillars, that really is going to stand out, right? But and what it does is it signals a part. But remember this, mirror neurons. If I yawn, hmm. You want to yawn, right? Some of you are doing it right now. Here's the thing. When mirror neurons work, whether it's through face-to-face -face or whether it's through, again, media such as this. So when the eyebrows go up, you know, again, you don't want to overemphasize. It don't look weird, but it's like a little eyebrow flash. Hey, good to see you. Hey. What it does is it signal the mirror neurons, and they also, well, many times, I've done this hundreds of times, you'll see the eyebrows go up. What does that do? It triggers. It's like, an, it's like a trigger for an anchor of attention. We grab focus. You literally grab focus. You can break a pattern with just an eyebrow flash. You grab focus. Also, when do people give? When do people unconscious? Remember, this is unconscious, but you can do it consciously. So when do people unconsciously do an eyebrow flash? Well, they do it when they're making a statement, when they're putting emphasis on something. They do it many times when they are trying to, when they're surprised. There's a focus, a surprise. They're looking for approval. And so this is very, it's like a focal point. So when you meet someone, as simple as this may sound, just do a little eyebrow flash. Hey, how are you? Test it. it. may sound silly, but it's something that once you've done it over and over and over, consciously, you'll begin to do it unconsciously. Then when people see you and that eyebrow flash goes up, it's all, oh, wow, that's it. Imagine for a moment. Imagine you see someone that you haven't seen in quite a while. What do you do? You, your eyebrows go up. You're like, oh, wow, good seeing you again. It triggers an emotion within you, a positive emotion. The same when you meet someone, you, they do an eyebrow flash. The mirror neurons in their brain starts firing off with an eyebrow flash. And all of a sudden, you've gained focus, you've gained attention, and you've even gained a small amount of unconscious rapport. Now, I don't talk about this specifically because it's kind of hard to show in a book. But this is one of the techniques that we use, and there's so much more. If you want to pick up my book, Secrets of Instant Rapport, we talk about how to build rapport, how to connect with people, and we even go through a formula, a four-step formula of unconscious rapport. So again, you pick it up on Amazon, you can pick it up on Audible, again, Secrets of Instant Rapport. But I wanted today to just take two minutes and share with you the ability to build unconscious rapport. And again, it's one level, it's just one small step and to gain attention. Also, if you've built that rapport, now I'm not gonna get into a lot of this, there's something we'll do on a future video or do with my private clients, but there is something that you can do that when you're asking for a sale, when you're asking someone to take action, how do you anchor that emotion to something as simple as body gestures and, and even eyebrow flashes? We'll talk about that at another time. But again, hope this has been helpful. Be sure to follow, subscribe, give me some comments.